Hey guys, it's your boy Sivanos. Welcome to Sivanos HD. If this is your first time here, kindly click on the red subscribe button, subscribe to this channel, and also click on the bell icon for notifications. So whenever I drop new videos, you're always updated and notified. Don't also forget to follow me on Instagram with Master Bless. Follow me on Instagram. Let me know the kind of videos you want to see, and I'll make that for you guys as usual. CK reacts as haters drag him um, over his re recent achievement. And also, actress Moyo Lawan reveals how Sutos run away because she refused to have intercourse with them. Also, a businessman, Van Laren, also tells ladies that you shouldn't tell, um, never tell a man that you should never tell a man that his bola is weak. That when you tell your man that his bola is weak, he will go out and, you know, try it with other women. But before we get to all these juicy stories, let's start with the story of uh, a lady who said she feels offended by men who toast her, like, like men who approach her and they don't measure up to her standard. Young lady triggered mixed reaction after stating how disrespectful she finds getting attention from men who do not measure up to her. According to the lady identified as Undoka Babe on Twitter, it's a big slap on her face when men who are beneath her in all ramification try getting her attention. She tweeted, I really get offended when I'm approached by men who don't measure up to me. Like you gauge yourself, then assess me and really thought you had a chance. So disrespectful. Don't ever attempt such behavior again because I will disgrace you without hesitation. A claim, however, triggered reactions from social media users, some of which supported her standard while others mocked her for a high taste. Guys, let's take a look at um, people's reaction to this. Somebody said, This sounds like a cry for help because you are going on and on, sis. You safe. It gets men where you know reach their level, so I beg rest. The kind of men you are looking for are not looking for your kind either. She has the right to set a standard, well done, but ask her this question when she turns 42 plus and no man has come and then she realizes how good looking her security man has been and she never noticed. That's if she has one. She will smash this standard by herself last last. Men should be more intentional about setting standards too. We need to match this energy, make everybody know them level. Lastly, another person said, what if the one you think are up to your standard doesn't see you worthy enough to roll with. Truth is, most times we attract what we look like. Stop making it seem like those that approached you aren't human beings. Guys, what do you think about what this lady is saying? And what do you think about this last comment by Omotayo of Lagos saying we attract what we look like? Do you think it's wrong for other men just because she feels like they are not in a level? Do you think it's wrong for them to approach her? Guys, let me know what you think about this in the comment section. Businessman Francis advises lady to never ladies to never tell a man his bola is weak because another woman will give him an Oscar performance. US-based Nigerian businessman Francis Van Lare has advised women against telling a man that he cannot perform in bed just to spite him. According to him, making such statement to a man might make him engage in extramarital affairs to test the strength of his bola in bed. Francis, who has been married and divorced five times, took to his social media page to disclose this as he recounted his personal experiences with one of his ex-wives. He wrote on Facebook, Sometimes negative things said about you is your tonic to get up and excel to prove them wrong. One lady I was once married to could not find anything her mouth could spit out to shake my confidence in the middle of a heated argument, so she resorted to personal attacks. She said my gola was weak and could not perform and all the orgasms she has been exhibiting were fake, just to make me feel good. Instead of allowing that statement to dampen my spirit, which was never intent, I called up a babe that has been chatting me up and I have not paid attention to her to meet me. My Gbola and Akpekus connected well and she had 9 orgasms that is not faked. So when the so-called wife repeated the statement again, I was grinning ear to ear as I have my independent tester to prove her wrong. And in the meantime, deny that my bola, she can go and find her own mandigo, not me. Never tell a man that his bola is weak or cannot perform to spite him. Another woman will give the same bola an Oscar performance. Guys, what do you think about what this man is saying? Oh, guys, just to say you want to smash the other lady, just to say they your eye. But guys, what do you think about this? Girls, you've heard Francis. Don't tell your man that his bola is weak and he, he cannot perform. If not, he will go and test it to another ladies. But guys, what do you think about what Francis is saying? Let me know what you think about this in the comment section. Now to one of the main stories of today. Um, singer CK reacts to negative reactions 
on his latest achievement saying that he will never understand the hate. Fast rising Nigerian singer Chukuka Ekwaini, popularly known as CK, has reacted to the negative reactions that trade his latest achievement. The singer's hit single Love Wants in Tea, which became an internet anthem after he went viral on TikTok, is currently topping charts on several music streaming platforms and he currently received his first ever Brit certified silver plaque in the UK. Revealing his accomplishment, CK dug out an old tweet he made in 2020 where he declared himself a global star. According to him, that tweet makes more sense now that he has gained global recognition. He said, CK is a global star. Then a year later, he retweeted it saying, A year later, this tweet hits different, doesn't it? However, some Twitter users didn't feel the same way and they slammed him for making a big deal out of one single that blew up. One Victory Frank tweeted, Because of one TikTok song, you never even try and rain for four years, you they make noise. I beg, or oh God, they try and make another hit song. No be all those one million remix on one song. And that person said, What the F, you are, you are a star only in Nigeria, not globally. In Tanzania, we don't know that name CK. The singer has now addressed those crying over his tweet. He wrote, I will never understand the hate, honestly. If I win, it's a win not just for me, but for the entire culture. You can see it that way or cry. I don't give a F. T.S. Sorry. Oh. Guys, what do you think about this? You know, ever since this Love One Tin Tin song went viral, a lot of people are saying, you know, you know, this song has gotten about a billion streams on TikTok. And, you know, a lot of people are saying CK is going to beat David O. He's going to beat Whiskey and Bonaboy to become, you know, one of the top celebrities and you know very soon ck is going to be the next big thing but guys what do you think about this do you think ck can take whiskey's position do you think love wanting thing can give ck that grammy position guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section guys let's take a look at the moment um z fancy gets arrested by military officers for allegedly pranking someone a viral video on social media captures the moment popular skit maker z fancy was arrested by military officers while carrying out a prank it was gathered that the soldier weeks him away for allegedly doing a risky prank on someone which caused the military men to arrest him. In the video, the skit maker whose content revolves around street pranks could be seen wearing tracksuits and white sneakers while being escorted by the military men into their Hilux vehicle. A film director, Paul, who filmed the dramatic moment, revealed that his phone was almost seized by the army men who refused to believe that it was just a prank. Guys, let's take a look at the video of Z Fancy, my OG, being taken away. Still on the update, um, actress Muyo Lawan reveals how she lost numerous suitors because she refused to sleep with any. Nollywood actress Muyo Lawa takes to social media to inquire if a relationship can actually exist without premarital wrong. In an Instagram post, the Covey actress noted that she has lost numerous suitors because she has refused to sleep with any of them. She further stated that these men still turn around to blame her for the failed relationship. The actress also admitted to the fact that she had had a few relationships that lasted without intercourse. But as the case may be, she wasn't ready then. Lamenting on her verified Instagram page, she wrote, I'm possible because the number of suitors who left because I refused them. Oh, and they blamed me for not allowing the relationship progress. Like how after waiting for a few months, so but anyways, if you can't beat them, you but wait oh, I just realized is it possible? I had few relationships that lasted without, but I wasn't ready. Life oh I'm curious, indulge me. Is it possible for a man to fo follow fo follow in love with a woman without ex? Like we are talking this generation or not our parents generation guys what do you think about this and what the, what what the hell is uh, moyo lawa saying is she a child is she a virgin why is she acting like she has never done it before and like stressing the niggas <laughs> guys do you think you know abstaining from it while you know knowing someone and newly you like you started dating someone makes a difference than when you do it when you start you start dating at first let me know and guys can you date a girl without having intercourse let me know in the comment section 
That is all for this video, guys. Let me know what you think about this video and everything we talked about in this video in the comment section. And if this is your first time here, kindly click on the red subscribe button, subscribe to this channel, and also click on the bell icon for notifications. So whenever I drop new videos, you always stay updated and notified. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at masterbless. I really, really appreciate that. Follow me. Let me know the kind of videos you want to see, and I'll make that for you guys. And if you want to call out any celebrity, like I told you, hit me up on Instagram with that Silvanos HD and I'll do that for you guys. Take care, stay safe. Thank you for making it to the end of this video. I really appreciate every single one of you and peace.